Hello everyone, Kate Carl here with you again with more tech tips during February 2025. Today I want to focus in on some of the really neat additional tools within your AI assistance. Focusing on Chat GPT and Claude today, and we're looking at how we can use our own documents from Google Drive to help with our chats and conversations. And it's really useful. So if you're a Google Docs user and an AI tools user, this will be helpful for you. Share my chat GPT with you first. I'm over here in a project for my Welsh Evans family. And I've got some projects that I'm working on at the moment. This project also has files in it and my instructions on how it should respond. Today, I just want to show you how you can draw in information from your Google Drive. Click the plus button here to give you your choices of where chat should get your documentation from, either from your computer or from Google Drive. Let's try Google Drive takes me immediately into my Google Drive. And from here, I can select my folders and files. This is my current folder. And we're looking for um, genealogy research project. So we're drilling down now. And I'm looking for the Evans family research. And here are some of the documents that I've got in place. So I want to click this one, this one, and select these two to bring in as examples for my next question. So you can see here that it has done exactly that. It's brought in beyond the farm gate and the first clue. Now these are chapters that I'm building in my family history detective memoir. And I'm storing all of the finished products over in weare.xyz. About that and another tutorial. I can now go ahead and ask questions from ChatGPT's ability to analyze documents and to suggest improvements. So let me do that. And I will suggest that it does this one by one. Find this a useful way to work through with ChatGPT, breaking it down into smaller tasks. So I want to analyze the documents and have it suggest improvements. See how it goes with that by activating that prompt. And just in a few seconds, it says that it will begin with the Beyond the Farm Gate. Actually, that is chapter two in my memoir. I should have asked it to do the other one first, but no matter. It's done exactly what I want. It's looked at its strengths. It is with what it's saying, then some areas for improvement. This is exactly what I have been thinking that the phrase AI analysis or AI tools has been used, overused throughout. And this was because I had asked my AI tools to include that as a style. So areas of improvement contain also personal connections, clarify the role of the women, smoother transitions between sections, Trim redundant details and potential addition as visual aids or maps, which I have already done over in the R.xyz. And then it says, Would I like it to refine a specific section or whether it should go on to the next one? So I will have some fun with that today. 
So it's a quite simple matter to add documentation from your Google Drive and your chat to the Let's pop over to Claude now. And it's also a simple process to add documentation from Google Drive. You'll see in this page that's already showing the Google Drive symbol. So I can click onto that and it will allow me to get articles, documents, etc. from my Google Drive. So there's the one called Beyond the Farm Day. Okay. And then I can ask the same question. Before I do that, I'm going to choose a style. This is one of the things that Claude does really well in transforming your stories into compelling narratives. Under the drop-down list here for Choose Style, you'll see four that come with Claude, normal, concise, gives you shorter responses and more messages, explanatory, educational responses for learning, formal, clear and well-structured responses, and allows you to create and edit your own styles. So I've created one called the Ancestral Storyteller, and it will explore family histories through introspective, meticulous, and empathetic storytelling. Choose that one today and activate this. So I'm looking for the same sort of response on analyzing the document and suggesting improvements, giving it the style that I prefer. Board comes back with the strengths and now for suggested improvements. Board goes a step further. It actually gives me examples of what I could use as replacement texts where it has suggested those changes. So once again, I can go back over my document and have some fun with these suggested improvements. So if I want that paragraph, of course, I can simply copy my picture. So both tools have done extraordinarily well with using my links to Google Docs. I hope that you will find this useful if you have Google Docs that you want to use within your AI tools. Be back later with more tips on your genealogy journey. Maybe 25.